This is the future of Texas. Thank you for joining us on NBC 23 this morning. Omar Garza is here Ooh, from Pure Fitness over yay. in Brownsville. Hey. Now he's here to give us some tips because we know we've all indulged on some food oh, yesterday. Yeah. We're probably going to continue with the leftovers yeah. and why, move why on. Why are you making me stand right now? I know, right? I asked Danielle to join. She wasn't ready for this, but we got her out here. So we want to learn more about you know nutrition, trying to get back into those habits, mm -hmm. and then some few exercises that you're going to demo. We might join you, Omar. Mm -hmm. I encourage but, you to join yes. us. Yeah. But I thank you this. so much for, for being here with oh, us this morning. Morning. But first of all, yeah, a lot of us are indulging on the holiday meals, maybe something not traditionally that we eat throughout the week. So we're eating <laughs> a little heavier these days. How do you get back on track? What is your suggestion for, um, for getting You there? just take it one day at a time. Okay. I mean, everybody always, you know, falls off the, the wagon. You mm -hmm. just get back on and you take it one day at a time. Um, people always try to over indulge in exercise like they do, you know, uh, sometimes with the eating, mm -hmm. you know, you just take it one step at a time get to the gym or if you don't have time for the gym do something at home get some movement you just need remember motion is lotion for the body okay you, you just need movement like you need to to uh, like increase the body temperature you need to sweat a little bit yeah you know what i was thinking is sometimes my excuse for not working out is like oh i don't i can't set aside an hour but it's like really you don't even need that it's just whatever you can do right 20 30 minutes you know yeah. sometimes more okay. than enough Okay. Yeah, now some people say I don't have equipment, mm -hmm. I don't True. can't afford a gym, a subscription, but a you trainer. have a body. There you <laughs> go. That's, that's more than enough. You have a body, I mean you you can get a real good workout. So what I'm hearing here from Omar is there's no excuse. <laughs> hey, pretty much. Yeah. All, right. <laughs> All right. What are some of the excuses you hear the most? Um <laughs> like this morning we have Black Friday. Okay. Oh. You know, we also have Black Friday at the gym, but people would choose to you go, you know, spend money yeah. instead of a uh, calories so. yeah, yeah okay so now you know in your role as a trainer as a gym owner how do you encourage people like maybe our viewers that are watching right now how would you encourage them to get moving get go go out and walk okay, okay. start walking yeah you, you know, know what we do that adam and i because yeah. we have our puppies yeah. and we walk our puppies and then um i do get clients that they they tell me well i walk i said and actually that's not enough okay, you okay. Know, we, we need to be doing some sort of exerting exercise got it so what is enough you want to show us maybe some some of these? Speaking of exerting I can, exercise, I can demo and you can join me. Okay. All right, we need to work these bases out. Let's go and see. I know last time I was here it was a little bit more stretching. You mm -hmm. know, mm -hmm. um, what I'm going to demo is some floor exercises. Okay. You know, it, and it's it's very beneficial if you sit all day, and mm -hmm. even if you don't. We do that. Yeah. You know? Okay. Yeah. So we're, we're going to start on the ground. Let's see. Okay. Let's see if we can, can do just, this. You can watch. Oh, we're going to do a, a push up. Okay. Not yet. Not yet. We'll show some progressions. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So real good exercise is a superman. Oh. You're pretty much here, arms extended, legs extended. You're gonna come up, you're gonna squeeze your scapula, you're gonna squeeze your glutes. Okay. Remember we want apples, not applesauce. <laughs> <laughs> so you're gonna that. come up right here, nice little squeeze, and come yeah. right back down. Superman. You know, anybody yeah. have back issues, superman. don't raise your legs. Okay. You can just pick up your arms. Some people don't have that range of motion. Modify here. Basically, what you're trying to do is you're trying to squeeze the scapulas. Right? And the because scapulas are? I need to, I in forgot between my shoulders. In between the shoulders. Okay, yeah. I, forgot, I forgot Because we classes. drive so much or work so much in, in front of the computer in, or in the office, yeah. we tend to start protracting the shoulder. Okay. So it's so kind of offset it. Got it. Now, that's something that anybody can do. Anybody it's the floor. We all have a floor. Um, okay. Yeah, you know yeah. what? That, that position reminds me, if you've ever been indoor skydiving, then you know that's the position that they tell you to use. Your arms up, chin up, and then your you know, legs that's out. That's also the position Superman uses. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> makes sense. Oh, it makes you sense. That. Another exercise <laughs> is, is called a bird dog. Okay. So you're pretty much on all fours. And what you're trying to do is you're trying to focus on your breathing, engaging your core, and you're just reaching straight out. Okay. You don't have to pick up your leg, just straight. Mm. And then you come back. Mm -hmm. So I always give clients a cue okay. for their breathing. Yeah. Because people, these exercises are tedious. Okay. Yeah. Nobody likes them. People want to get down into the good stuff. Yeah. But they're very beneficial you okay. know, if you do them correctly. Yeah. yeah. Now tell me about breathing. I know it's hard sometimes our minds say, hold your breath so you can stretch, so you can do that, <sighs> that next set or rep. So how important is that? Breathing is, is autonomous. You do it without thinking. Mm -hmm. But some new goers in the gym, they focus more on what they're doing and they do neglect the breathing. Okay. Okay. And the, the, there's always different phases in exercise, you know, and everybody doesn't, you know, get the breathing at the same rate mm -hmm. or yeah. same pattern that other people do. Okay. So I just tell them, just don't hold your breath. Air goes in, air goes out. 
you know, and you avoid getting dizzy, you avoid, you know, um, feeling nauseous in the gym. Mm -hmm. Okay, and what do you think are some of the, the top exercises that people should be doing at home or that you would recommend? I mean, classic is your push-up. Okay. And there's so yeah. many different progressions to push-ups. Yeah. And then besides a the push-up, you got your squats, you got your lunges. Now, if people have, you know, knee issues, you know, I mean, if you go to a restroom every day, you sit on the toilet, you can squat. Yeah. You know, put a chair behind you. It's for all populations, mm -hmm. you know, and... If you live in a two-story house mm -hmm. or you have access to a step, okay. you know, that's something, that's, that's an addition you can do. Got it. Okay, wow. so we have about a minute left. For, for somebody that doesn't want to get on the floor, that can do something standing up or in place, what can we do? Can you show us what we can do here? Okay, we can yeah. do a squat. Okay. Okay. So what are we going to do? Separate your feet shoulder width apart. Shoulder width. Okay. Stick out your hips. Uh, okay. Up we go. Okay. Perfect. Oh, I can do, do that? Yeah. Okay. Woo! I and feel this, that burn. What is this working? Is it working your quads, your okay. glutes? Your hamstrings. Mm. If you focus on that breathing and you brace, you're gonna get some core action. All right. Mm. Cool. I need that core right there. <laughs> <laughs> and since right now there's a lot of family gatherings, so you know, pick up yes. a kid or something, and you know, just start squatting. Oh, oh. at the at the weight. I can pick yeah. up my puppy. Or your turkey. Or, you my puppy's you know, 27 After pounds. Black Friday, all your your shopping. All, all your right. shopping bags. All right. Cool. <gasps> oh, I like all that. Right. Well, before we move on to a break, where can we get more information about Pure <laughs> Fitness? Uh, we're in Brownsville, Texas. Mm -hmm. uh, you can look us up on Facebook or Instagram, uh, Pure Fitness 2009. Uh, the website. You know, we're next to UPS on Price Road. Perfect. You know, you're more than welcome to stop by. All right. One more message for our viewers to get moving. Um, if there's something you need to, to change on your nutrition, which is everybody's struggle, mm -hmm. yeah. just start eliminating sugar. Okay. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's yeah. Sorry. Some of our favorites, oh, right? Yeah, yeah. All right. Sugar well, we'll start. But for our, our health. Then. Awesome. All right. Omar, thank you so much for being thank here with you. us. Thank you. All right.